Today is a very interesting day because I'm taking on 50 golfers, kind of, and I'm going to do it now. Hi everyone, James Robinson here. Guys, first things first, I'd like to warmly welcome you all back to the channel and also back to a wonderful, which is now sunny, Huddersfield Golf Club. I actually got layered up today because it was freezing this morning and I'm doing a Beat the Pro here on the eighth hole. The reason for that is last time I did a Beat the Pro here on the eighth hole, somebody got a hole in one. So chances are someone might have one again. It's quite a nice flag position. The hole isn't playing overly difficult today and I'm taking on 50 golfers-ish, I think and hopefully one of us will get a hole in one. Hopefully it'll be me. So stay tuned and also guys, get in the comments below how many of those golfers will beat the pro. Probably a lot of them. So guys, if you missed the what's in the bag the other day, then make sure you go and check that out. This isn't playing too difficult today. The flag is at the front and it's around 140, 130 yards. I've not zapped it just yet. So I'm gonna go with maybe a little nine. How's the game going boys? This is where you all beat me. <laughs> yeah, there's a sneaky wind, isn't there? I've got a nine. I'm not sure if that's enough, because essentially, if you go long... I also used to test it like a seven or eight. Yeah. Seven or eight, yeah, depending on that wind, but it's blowing, isn't it? Yeah. I think if you go long, it should come back a bit, shouldn't it, on the, on the, on the slope? So all we want, but all we want, boys, really, is a hole in one for the video. So if one of you could do that, that's a flat tire. That. Oh, I'll tell you what. Get left. Ooh. So the first person that I uh, took on last time when I beat the pro got a hole in one. So you've let us down, yeah. The last time, honestly, on this Bokeh Golf Day, first person <laughs> hole in one. Really? Yeah. I'll tell you what. Get up. Get up. Ooh. I think that wind is catching, isn't it? It's a great strike. Just sit. Ooh, nasty bounce. Oh, here it is. Ooh. Bang on line. Right. I won't say nothing. Oh, James, that's left. Uh, first one of the day missed. <laughs> no. So as first shots go, that was shit. Um, so I'm hoping there's a bit of a gap between these, and I think there is, so I'm going to hit three or four up, have a bit of a loose, and I've not hit a golf ball today yet. Quite disappointed with that, really. Very, in fact, very disappointed with it. So I'm not sure if that's the right club. It was a nine. It was pin high up there, but it was left, and I'm a bit warm now. So I think I'm going to de-layer, because uh, that obviously makes a big difference as well, doesn't it? You can go on there, you can go off, and then you can go in there, and then you can go off. Ugh. Then you can go back on. And that should do it, I think, if you heard that. And the coast is clear for at least a couple of minutes, so I'm going to try and hit the same club again with a glove up there and see if we can actually come on play some decent shots winds off left into i've teed up a bit high the knee's still not great yet. and that's what you get oh that was a shank Oh, that's good. Bunker. I think it might be a full one, you know. It might be. Or, do we club up and hit a little eight? That's another shank. 
I think we will club up and hit the eight because that's rubbish. Right, one more warm up shot and I'm going to chip an eight up. The wind is up as well. That could be at it. See, that's the shot. So we know we can hit it. I'll go and pick these up. So after the uh, warm up, um, the shots were probably about as good as where I positioned that camera. Not very good. We got one which was decent, about four foot, and the rest. Not sure if I'm looking forward to today or not, Dave. Go. I apologise for that. That was a terrible shot. It's actually going all right. <laughs> Nice. This could be very good. Love it. Very good. Well done, boys. What were your opinions on that shot, gentlemen? <laughs> I'm not, 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 I'm absolutely devastated to be honest, although to claim a one after that would have been a bit naughty, so... So after having three hole-in-ones myself, I think that's the closest I've ever come without having one. It was one of the worst strikes as well, it was a horrible, thin, scuttly one, but we're getting closer. A lot closer, I can't believe that. Next time. I need to build some confidence up. Confidence on ball striking isn't there which is a horrible thing when you're doing something like this. But we're honest and hopefully it's relatable. Guys, if you're enjoying it, smash the subscribe button, leave us a like and yeah, just sit back and enjoy. I'm gonna put as many shot tracers on as we can. You're all in luck I've just hit it to about two inches. So it can't go better than that, can it? <laughs> You've just hit it to about two inches. Right? <laughs> it was a terrible shot as well, that was the worst part. Yeah, you, you guys wanna go first? Try and put the pressure on? I mean, check this out for some shots on a beat the pro. Quite remarkable. I'll clear mine off, boys, and I'll let you crack on. Should we go? There's a tailor made one. That is, honestly, that's unbelievable. And I'm up here. Is that you? Yeah. I think they all had a chance as well, you know. So do I beat you as well? Oh, I don't know about that. You probably do actually look at that angle. I well done, I chaps. Do. I think I do. I, I think you do. No. Yeah, very good. Yeah. No, that's, that's the... Right, I'll not see you in. <laughs> I'll tell you what, that is unbelievable. So I've been that close. That chap should probably got his name really sorry. It was like that close as well. And I bet some of these shot traces are looking absolutely awesome. Surely we're going to have a one today. Surely. Like it's not a hard flag. The only thing that's difficult is the wind. The wind, as you can probably hear, because I'm filming this on my phone, the wind's difficult, so... Mm -hmm. Oh, this is good. Hold your line. Yeah, nice shot, mate, that. Right, get up. Flash to the short. No, that's okay, that's pin high. That's, right. Yeah, that'll, do. that'll turn out very nice, actually. Look 
looking for broken tea bag. Ah, not good. I think all of you have to be fair with that. So that one wasn't very good. Two good ones in a row there before that, so I'll let myself off. So we have one on the green for this group. Uh, mine's all the way up here. A pull, horrible long pull. Not what we want. Out of a handful of shots so far, we had two very good ones. One which obviously nearly went in, but was a terrible strike. And isn't it funny, Al, would you rather have a terrible shot or a terrible strike, a, a terribly performed shot that finishes that close? You obviously would. Or would you rather have a really nice struck one that's just not quite as close? To be honest, I either want a one or I want to see a one. Or I feel like I've let you guys down, myself down, and everyone down. So, knee hurts as well today. Again, not the best there. We have had a spectator today for every single shot. Uh, Ray. Ray, how would you rate my performance so far? Uh, not very good at the moment. No, it wasn't, was it? Uh, one good shot. Uh... Two good, two. Two, two. two good shots, but uh, <laughs> apart from that, everything's okay. <laughs> <laughs> Wonderful to see you, right? You know, it's funny, isn't it? Because I always enjoy things like this, and I always think that they're going to be really, really fun, and that you're basically going to stick it close loads and loads of times and make loads of birdies. And then reality kicks in, and you start shanking a few in the warm-up, and you really don't feel that comfortable. I'm even hiding behind my bag, and I didn't realise. Hmm. Definitely don't need that. I might actually change the approach now. I might go this side instead and just play it. Although that brings the bunker into play even more. Uh, maybe we'll stay at that side. Also, that wasn't mine. I don't know whose that was, but that's disgusting. Ooh. How are you doing? Yeah, no, enjoying it. It's a lovely nick. Yeah? Yeah, yeah lovely nick. Good stuff. Um, so, a little peek pro. I'm sure you all probably, probably will. Most people have been doing. Oh, really? Cool. No pressure then. Are you yeah. giving us pal what you, what you recommended? I'm chipping a little later, but I've had, I've had a couple of really close ones and a couple of shanks into the trees, so it's either <laughs> it's all mixed. Yeah, welcome to my world. Yeah. <laughs> Beautiful start. Did you see the wake transfer? Beautiful <laughs> start. Seriously, oh. did you see the wake transfer? And that's one of the worst ones of the day. Is it? <laughs> no. <laughs> Just do that again. Just do it again. Wait and transfer. Lovely. He can't transfer his weight. I keep telling him. He's clouting it for long. This is where we shank it now. Watch it. I don't actually know what you mean when you say that. Weight transfer. I think I transfer. Yeah, come here and watch him. I'm going to watch him from here. Yeah, his weight's yeah, already there. Oh, I'll tell you what, it's a good job hitting that one. Oh, that's long, long, that one. Oh, long, yeah. It's all over it though, isn't it? Up. Yeah, that's it, yeah. Right, boys. I don't think it's safe. No, it's not. It's, I'll, I'm trying to like, because oh, it right. has been into the wind the whole time. I think it's a shame. Like yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think it's eight, I think it's six. Well, I can hit two iron if you want. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So what are you on 32 then? So what are you going with? Nine. There's a bit of wind behind, isn't there? Same shot, virtually same shot as I just played over there. Shot. <laughs> I can't believe that yellow ball's not closer, but yeah. anyway, it's not, is it? So, no. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. it. so that's life. That's, <laughs> that's life, man. This group just a little bit too too much, really. Uh, I hit two, and they're both here. So I'm going to take that, really. Proximity to the flag, not bad at all. So I feel like whilst I'm walking back down to the tee, I'm giving you a bit of a kind of recap the whole time. They were two good shots, two shots that have built some confidence and I wish, to be honest, I wish I'd have had a proper warm up as well on the way there. Um, because, as I keep saying it, this is a hole in one flag all day long. The wind's actually changed now as well. I got caught out on the second shot. You may have heard the guys ask me to hit another one just to show them the difference in a kind of weight transfer, which is always nice. It's nice to hit more golf shots, but it went long. So do I now club down and go at a full nine, if my knee will take it? Uh, 
yeah i think we will for this next one i'm not sure how many are left actually but enjoying it guys i hope you're enjoying it as well like i said smash the subscribe button if you are enjoying it let's get a one come on the home for the day sort of turn you back on go Pin high, which for the blustery wind was decent, but not uh, not the arrow we wanted. So I think if my memory serves me right, there's one more group. So last chance for an Uno. I know the title says 50, and I thought there was 50. Apparently there's now not 50, but 50 is a better number for a video in it. So there you go. Right, come on, guys. Get in the comments. Wish me all the luck in the world because i'll need it for a hole in one i'm a bit millet then for me to go first and try and put some pressure on or do you guys want some pressure on <laughs> it's either been sugar or Right, some interesting shots there and I actually forgot to start the main camera so anyway um, not my best certainly as you saw there yeah. so final group of the day and we have one on the green which wasn't myself but this gentleman well done great shot i'm up here towards that bunker rubbish so a very 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 mixed bag there and i must say some really good shots some shots which i really enjoyed a couple of four left at least the shanks were all in the warm-up and i'll keep them in as well because it's nice and relatable i'm sure a lot of you guys wonder what it's like to do a beat the pro it does get a little bit tetchy a little bit tense but really i've enjoyed it um some good some bad as it's always going to be guys let me know if you've enjoyed that let me know if it's something you want to see more of and apart from that smash that subscribe button if you haven't done already leave us a like i'll see you all tomorrow Oi. Right, we'll come over and have a word with the tournament organiser. Raymond, are you stealing my future wife? <laughs> yeah, yeah. If it were possible, yeah. <laughs> <laughs>